I ain't been this free since I was 13, 12 years old. Now I'm 55 years old. I'll be 56 this year. First I started selling like firecrackers, like 4th of July, I was selling firecrackers and stuff like that. Then I started selling weed when I was like 14 years old. And uh, I really didn't really start doing time until 1970, 1970. I ended up doing about 27 years before I entered the uh, May parole. Can you imagine 20, 27 years being incarcerated? I end up joining the nation. The nation is about dedication. You know, it's about doing all you can do for the betterment of yourself and your people. You have to study the law so you'll know what law to apply to try to get out of prison. The date I was given to be released was May the 15th, 2006. My brother, my son, and my nephew came to pick me up. I had butterflies all the way home, all the way home. Being in shape, working out, man, is real good for the body, mind, and soul. I used to run 10 miles a day, five days a week. But uh, my job changed, I'm working at night now, so uh, I work out on Saturdays and Sunday mornings, and I work out three days during the week. I was uh, what they call traffic control. Setting up the traffic, the pattern for the new tra traffic. I seen this one car flying down the street. He was flying, he was balling, he was doing about six, about seven. And before I could turn back around, I was on media strip. Leg all broke up. But it was the uh, it was a horrific night that night, that morning. I didn't think I was going to be able to stand out here. You know, I done rolled past here several times, but I tried not to look or I tried not to think about where it happened and when it happened, how it happened. I never tried to look at that, I, you know. I just rolled past here and act like I never even been past this place before. But I always feel something inside when I'm, when I'm close to this area, when I come to this area. You gotta be limping, carrying the chain, going through pain. When the weather's bad, when it's cold raining. But I'm gonna live through it. I ain't, I ain't gonna let it tear me down. And that's what I've been doing, I've been moving on. Life is, life is what it is, you know? Every day is a struggle, you know? Struggle is ordained, you know? If I don't go through something in the day, then I don't think I'm living. So to be 58 and free from the penal system, man, that's a big plus. A lot of black men don't make it that far. You know, they come home, they keep going in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out because they didn't have no goals. They ain't set no goals when they was in. They just figure, okay, I go home, get a job, do this, do that. But it ain't that, it ain't that simple. It's hard. I think I, I come a long way. I thank a lot God for allowing me, man, to, to, to be on this earth, man, and, 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 and to give something back. <laughs> 